Ms. Vandermullen, was there an incident in 1976 in which Lyle Menendez asked you to help him? Yes, there was. Where did this take place? In my bedroom downstairs in the basement what in time Muncie. Of, I'm sorry. In Muncie. In Muncie. What time of day was it? It was nighttime. And what happened? We had all been down, Lyle and Eric and I had been downstairs and the boys had been called up to get ready for bed. I stayed and went into my bedroom and a while later Lyle came down and he was asking if he could, uh, I thought he was there to say goodnight and he started asking me if he could sleep down there because Kathy had already gone and there was two single beds. Okay, and what did you tell him? I initially, I uh, it pretty much just brushed him off because I wasn't taking him seriously. And what happened next? Um, he proceeded to indicate to me by touching himself uh, down and, and saying that his dad and him had been touching each other down there. And what did he ask you to do? He wanted to sleep down there. And what did you do? I went and got Kitty and uh, brought her downstairs and told her what was going on. How did Lyle seem this time? Was this a joke? Uh, no, he was very, he was serious. And what happened when Kitty came down? I, she didn't believe me. Did and you tell her? She, yes, I told her what I believed to be going on, what Lyle had, had was indicating to me. and. Uh, she immediately, I don't remember that she said anything to me, just that I knew that she did not believe me, and she took Lyle and, and brought him back upstairs. When you say she took him, did she, she physically she, grab him? She, Yeah, she took him by the arm and brought him back upstairs with her. And did you ever discuss the incident with Lyle anymore? No, we, it wasn't ever discussed after that. Thank you. That's our offer. All right, people wish to examine.